They can take off and land in the space of a football field, and perhaps that's why they're so popular. Twin Otter aircraft are in demand worldwide, which is great news for Viking Air on the South Island. Viking has announced a $65 million deal to build 12 Twin Otters for the government of Peru. And that's not all. They're hiring. Bruce Kirkpatrick reports. They're good on ice and snow. They're good in the desert. They're good on water. Twin Otters have been flying the world since the 1960s when de Havilland began building them. They stopped for 20 years, but now... Twin Otter headquarters at Viking Air in North Saanich. They used to repair old Otters. Now they're building brand new ones at $5.8 million each. Viking Air does a lot of business, mostly in countries far away. They chose the Paris Air Show to announce 12 Twin Otters for Peru. This is Otter 1 in a North Saanich hangar, 11 to go. Viking Air needs some more hired help. We're looking probably for another, uh, I'd say 50, and we're looking for uh, tradesmen, we're looking for engineers, and we're in a continual hiring pursuit uh, for the next 12 months. Well, this aircraft, Peru 1, it will be completed and they'll be going to Peru in two weeks. It seats 19 passengers. And it raises the question of assembly in Calgary and other bits done in Victoria. What's the split among 500 employees? We're about 300 and change here and about 130 over in Calgary. So the bulk of employment is still here in Victoria. It's nice to see like the new Twin Otters and working on them and being a part of um, designing them and uh, what they're going to forever be. I'll have a part of that. It is by and large a clean industry. Employees are well paid. They earn it building new aeroplanes. But even if they're fixing older otters. If you're digging around inside an old, an old pair of floats, trying to do some repairs, you get covered in sealant and muck and everything just like anybody else working on stuff. Okay by you. Yeah, it's okay by me. The list of orders or expressions of interest include 12 otters for Peru, 6 for Vietnam, 6 for the Maldives, 4 for Indonesia. They hope to complete 60 Twin Otters with a combined value of over $300 million. Is that good for the entire capital region? Oh, I would think so. I could see the airport becoming a great little center of activity for Viking Air, which will help other people around the airport, you know, food services, even delivery services and those kinds of things. It just trickles all the way through the economy. They're even good in Antarctica. No orders from the South Pole yet.